Hi there, we are going to do tall building design using the tabs considering wind load parameter in Bangalore. By looking at this figure, we can see the various beams and columns that have been given and we have to use auto select option for both beams and columns of various sections. Considering M40 concrete and HYHD 500 and mile 250 rebar and the slab as 150 mm thick and the various sections and grid lines as shown in the figure have to be constructed. Now go to define and add materials and define for the materials M40, mild steel 250 and HYST 500 by adding new materials. Again go to define section properties and add beams and columns by adding a new property and selecting the given dimensions in the questions I have already added and we have to select a auto select list as shown in this property the property of the list can be added by add, selecting add property and selecting the add property list similarly columns should also be considered now again go to section properties and add slab of 150 mm using draw option carefully draw beams and columns here I have already drawn after drawing carefully as per given questions loads have to be assigned on slabs a uniform load of dead load and live load have to be given as per the given question and on cladding 0.2 kN per meter is given on the beams Now go to the ground floor as shown in the figure Z is equal to 0 meters and select all the joints and go to assign and joints keep it as fixed. Now we will view all the loads acting on the structure. Now we are looking at gliding load. Now we will look at dead load and live load acting on the slabs. To assign wind load, go to assign and define load patterns and in there we have to use IS code to determine the various parameters. The first one we have to consider the velocity, the wind speed in Bangalore from the map we can see that it is 33. Terrain category, the next one is terrain category. From the code we can see that it belongs to category 3. And for the class again by looking at the IS code we can see that the Bangalore belongs, the structure belongs in class B as it is between 20 to 50 meters in height.
the coefficient is 1. and the k3 factor is also 1 because the wind velocity is between is 3 degrees wind load has to be assigned by going into the elevation and assigning the shell loads as given by the is code This can be viewed in the video. Now we are in final stage of the video that is to analyze the model and design. For analyzing the model, click on analyze and run. It will take long time as the number of floors are high. So I have fast forwarded the video. We can view the deformed shape of the structure and also we can view the bending moment and shear force of the structure. For designing, go to the design tab concrete frame design and click on start design check after checking the design it will prompt After clicking on yes, it will reiterate and redesign on its own. Again it may prompt with the failed members and again try to reiterate the structure.
now the design is complete to check whether all the members have passed go to design concrete frame structure and click on verify all members now that we have it now it has prompted that all the members have passed now the design is completed thank you for watching the video